And it is Thursday, so we've got some cool hot cool hot properties. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hot properties that are kind They're of cool. Cool hot properties. And the there first you go. one we're going to show you is actually a Canadian yep. property yep. from um, listen from Tragically Hip. Oh, that's a gorgeous Gordani's. house. Gord yeah, Gordani. In, in a Riverdale, a neighborhood in Toronto. Hip and happening in Riverdale. And this video. So you can actually, he, they posted a video that you can <laughs> see inside now, and obviously they did this themselves. Look. Oh, I like this. <laughs> so <laughs> cute. <laughs> listen, whatever it, whatever it takes to sell, right? So the house is listed cute. at 2.2. Four nine million and yeah. sold for two point two three. Boy, that's odd to me because Riverdale is a very desirable neighborhood and it went for a little Under less asked. than asking yeah. price. Sure yeah, it is. It's yeah. a great idea. What a cute video. I love it. You know what? Though they bought it in two thousand five for one point three, so that's a nice little profit there. That's not bad. It's lovely though. The yeah. fireplaces and all the hardwood. It's really nice. And yeah, that's like kind of a, a. I don't want to use the word unassuming house, but it's like an unassuming house in Riverdale. You know, just one of the houses in Riverdale in Toronto area that's really. Yeah, but it's obviously been all updated and renovated. And yeah, no, it looks great. Cool. Oh wait, but wait, there's more. Outside. Oh, we're outside <laughs> now. This is a great space. Oh, I love it. Look at that. Here's what I can see. Nice tree, yeah. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. A little panoramic view. Right. That's great. Should we go to Amy Schumer next? Amy Schumer. <laughs> Let's go to the unstoppable Amy Schumer and her NYC apartment. Oh, that's, well, you know what? That's it. And so instead of, you know, this kind of opulence that you might expect from the train wreck star, it's kind of, you know what, down to earth. It's big, yet comfortable. It's on the Upper West Side of New York. What so I this just it. listed for two million, just a little over two million. Look, see that fireplace, wood burning. Yes, love it. I it think there's a few of those I like in there. That. Wow. So it's it's only it's located in a, it, it, it's a apartment in a brownstone, mm -hmm. so it's yes. twenty feet wide. Yeah, there you go. Oh, I like this yeah. outside. Two point oh seven five million. Yeah. Mm. That's lovely. Okay. okay. And then we move along to Emily Blunt's place. So they just bought a place um, in Ojai. Wow. California bought it and then they flipped it back on the market. So they bought it for just over two million in June 2012, and now and now it's back on the market, but at 4.25 million. So she's is she married to John Krasinski from The Office? I believe they're married. Uh, yeah, at least they had this I house think together. So. They're, yes. certainly a couple. They're, they're certainly a couple. Yes. I'm sorry. And this house was where? Oh hi. Oh hi. Yes. I think. What's in Oh hi. Oh, hi, California. Look at that. Looks like the 80s. Wasn't Jamie house. Summers the $6 million woman? Oh, from my oh, yeah, gosh. You're right. Yes, she was. She <laughs> was. <laughs> she worked in Ojai. Yes, exactly. you're right. She I read the telephone that you books that. in Ojai. In Ojai. Oh, that's fantastic. Marks, this is your dream <laughs> house. Oh, my gosh. We've got to go. And Bev's, too. We both love the Bionic Woman. We're waiting for that movie. <laughs> Great. Yeah, yeah the Bionic there, Man is being redone, as we were talking about last week. So, like, maybe there'll be a Bionic Woman. Absolutely. But doesn't that look like the 8 is enough house? Yes, it does. It does look like the 8 is enough <laughs> <laughs> Dick Van Patten. Yeah, absolutely. The late Dick Van Patten, yeah.